now we're going to learn how to make things move in Photoshop or animation, if you will. So, first of all, we're going to start a new document. We're going to keep it on the web settings there that we have. Let's click, bring that in the middle a bit more. Now we need to uh, open up a new window that doesn't always come up. You've got to go into the window area up here, and here's all your hidden tools that aren't always up there. So we're going to go to animation, this one here. Click on that and we can get a little, uh, a little bar down the bottom here. That should pop up. Now what we want to do, say we let's make a little ball. I'm going to make a red ball. I'm going to draw that shape right there like that. Now on your animation uh, window we're going to click we're gonna make let's make four, five, five different animation cells. And we're gonna go to the second one. And we wanna I'm just using the arrow keys, you can use your mouse too. Just gonna knock it up a little bit and to the right. Actually, it's usually easier if you do it like this. Okay. So once we've moved that, you can say see, see it's moved a little bit more. Now we want to duplicate that layer. Let's move it up to the side a bit more. Let's duplicate that layer. Do the same. Just going to keep doing that until it gets where we want it to. Okay, so let's go and press play. And there you can see we got the start of an animation of the ball moving. Um, we can change how quickly we want that to do that. I mean, if you don't want it to be that fast, we can move them up to 0.2 of a second, or whatever you want. It's going to look a little bit more slow-mo. So yeah, that's basically uh, that's the start of it anyway. So I mean, you can spend hours uh, doing animation. You know, if you want to draw different cells or make text flash on and off like you see on a lot of our animated banners all over the web. You can do all that kind of stuff by using this animation uh, feature of Photoshop. So that's how we uh, move things in Photoshop.